gentlemen. We're here to remember Ian Twitchin. Uh, tell us about some of your memories of Ian and the uh, time he had at Talking United Football Club. Well, my first memory of, of Twitch was when I signed in 1977. He was the first player to come up to me and make me feel really welcome. And our friendship went on from there. Uh, a great player, one-man club. Um, you know, he just played over 400 of games. Um, an absolute legend. And uh, I'm so pleased he's been been appreciated by Torquay and I'm really thankful to Torquay the fact that they've named a, one of their exclusive squeaks after him and um, yeah a great player great to play with. John your memories? I would uh, reiterate what uh, Peter's just said but um, what I would say is Twitchin is a lovely lad lovely person great family man but he would kick his grandma on the football pitch. There's no two ways about it. His attitude great. He's. Uh, I never he heard. Did you ever hear him moan, Peter? He never ever moaned. He got never on with, got on with people. Got on yeah, with, he if, did. if he was told he had to play midfield, he'd play midfield. He'd do it. If he'd said you've got to play left back, he'd go left back. Yeah. Obviously, most of his career was at right back, and playing in front of him as a right winger was superb. Because if I cut inside, he'd come outside me. I could play him. He was just just great to play. His his energy was fantastic, and. John here who's had a fantastic career will tell you his highlight of the career is... Is, I used to beat Ian Twitchin in the Maidencombe run from here to Maidencombe and back. And when I left in 1981, Twitch said to me in his de <laughs> Devonia voice, I'm glad you've gone, John. He said, because I can get my crown back for the Maidencombe run. And another thing is that, you know, Twitch, he, I don't know what was in his head, but when... Players come to a club, they get great wages. And you know what? That lad played for Torquay for 11 years and people used to come to the club and get extortionate wages and he just sat, sat there and God. never moaned once. Yeah. You know where yeah. I come from, yeah. Pete, don't yeah. you? Yeah. He never said, oh, yeah. you're on £100 yeah. or eight more than me yeah. and this, that and the other. He just did it. Yeah, he was Torquay <clears> through and through. Yeah. And during the summer, myself and him, we used to work on a deck chairs at Timmouth Beach. And uh, and he was, he was great with people on the beach there. And when people knew him and he was just a, a really nice bloke to know and going back to the maiden coon run if i could just say that was never actually proven and the court and the jury is still out on that one John. it is uh, i can understand that <laughs> yeah. but i know the thing was he, he was a good footballer just going back to to play all those games for just one club you know you can't it's just an absolute legend absolute legend yeah, 400, over 400 games. 435 games. games and 17 league goals. Yeah. I never saw him. Do you, you ever see him score a goal? Oh, he scored a few. And, and to 17. Be honest, yeah, there's, there's 17 <laughs> goals. And most of the goals were important goals, you yeah. know. And he stopped a lot more than he scored, though. Oh, be, crikey. You know. You know. And, yeah. um, and for, for any of the supporters that might have been at his funeral in, in Tim Murphy, it was an absolutely, um, you know, it's a cho choking to see the how many people were there. The, the queue went all down the street. Mm -hmm. When we, The church was absolutely full to Ramped. bursting. It full was. to bursting. It was standing room only. And it just showed you how much he meant to the people of Timworth and the people of Torquay. You know, and um, I should never forget him. And I'm glad now we've got this exclusive yeah. and that People will not forget him now. And, and it'll uh, never happen again. Yeah, you never have a play like him again. No way, no way. Never. He's in our hearts forever, you know. Yeah. And, uh, his family. And, and Laura, especially his youngest, you know, she's worked so hard yeah, to, she has. to, um, to get his, his name, you know. And we want the, we want the new supporters of Torquay United to, to know who the, who the older players were, that, 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 you know, that put, put Torquay where it was. And, and you know, he, he deserves, he deserves the, the accolades he's been given by having this exclusive, you know, so. Definitely.